But Somalia's first pharmaceutical factory since the start of the country's civil war has opened its doors in Mogadishu. The Horn of Africa nation has not had such a firm operating there since the breakout of violence in the country three decades ago. The plant, which has been running for three months now, has set its sights on exporting its products outside Somalia while meeting the growing local demand. Mohamed Kakia visited the facility and filed the following report. With just three months in operation, Somalia's first pharmaceutical plant produces about 1 million doses of various tablets per month. The project is part of various healthcare partnerships between Somali and Turkish investors in order to revive the medical industry in the country. We have got um, a tableting and um, a capsule line at the moment uh, in terms of manufacturing. Our capacity as a manufacturer is, is sufficient enough. We're producing and manufacturing around um, one million tablets uh, uh, every month. Uh, for example, the last three months, we produce a lot of uh, tablets in the country. Our plan in the future is to set up, um, this is the two lines, as I told you, uh, capsule and tableting. And inshallah, next time we're going to, at the end of the year, we want to expand and start manufacturing uh, syrups as well as the injectables and salines as well. And we are starting to, uh, um, to register our product is, uh, into uh, Kenya and Ethiopia and Eritrea, Djibouti, as well as other countries in East Africa. And hopefully, inshallah, uh, expand the rest of Africa as well as the whole world. Um, our main uh, target is uh, to expand in our countries. And now we engage uh, uh, with the registration process of specifically in neighboring countries. Somalia imports almost all its pharmaceutical products after the few local production sectors closed following breakout of the conflict in early 1990s. Now with the revival of manufacturing, quality is very important. We do various procedural tests to ensure the quality standard of the products. For example, we perform identification tests, physical tests, uniformity tests, pharmaceutical tests and weight evaluation tests. All this is done because it is for human consumption. After the process is complete, it is packaged for marketing. Consumers have welcomed the locally produced drugs saying it saved them time and resources. We used to spend a lot of time and resources importing some of the medical products you see here. Now they are produced here at our doorsteps. We just order them and receive them in the same day, with less costs in card. The government of Somalia says it is working to strengthen legislations on drugs and medicine as it encourages investment in the much-needed sector. Hamid Kahi. CGT in Mogadishu, Somalia.